You are looking. What have you got? I can get you that one easy. There. Better than before. All my pieces are good, but that ready for battle. I must fight well, Eivor. One more, and only because you all have such good taste. Now, this one. This one begins a long time ago at a... Only a fool would pass this up. Be sure to keep these in stock for you. Then shopping. I'm. I hope to see you soon.
slow sips, Halfton. It helps the brew stay down.
away from my house, you ruffians. What's this ruckus? Stand back, Dane. There's a witch within that house. We've come to burn it down. She's no witch. She's Hafton's healer. That proves it. Dark magic, that is. Clear out, all of you, before I beat you senseless. Let's go, before they burn your cottage to cinders. I can't go out there. They'll steal me away and burn me at the stake. All right, I see two ways out of this, but neither is without risk. Do what you must, only hurry. I leave myself in your hands. I'm as good with words as I am with weapons. It'll take some convincing, but I can talk my way out of this. Lead on, then. I shall follow. <laughs> Go home, all of you. This woman is in my care now. Who died and made you sovereign of Northumbria now? I am the wolf kissed. Killer of men, feeder of ravens. Stand back or I will wear your bones as ornaments. Jesus. E ease up now. We was only protecting our hamlet here. Tell Hafton he can have her. Leave this woman alone. Leave her look away again and it will be the last thing you see. Moira, it is safe to go. Show me. You have my thanks, Ravenbearer. We'll be safe here. Thank you, Eivor. 
A thousand times I thank you. And if I ask you to drink your own brew? I would, gladly. And often do from time to time. To ensure it's not overly bitter before serving to Halfton. When you said there's no cure for what ails Halfton, you mean he's touched in the head? I fear so. The same malady bedeviled my mother. The body breaks down and the mind falls apart over time. It's a terrible thing. I need your help, Moira. The brews you mix for Hafton, what goes into them? Oh, quite a diverse mixture. Let me see. Lavender, rosemary, meadow sweet, yarrow, soothing herbs, nothing uncommon. I should return to Hafton. He said he would be at the Temple of Flora. Tread lightly this topic with him, if you would tread it at all. Hail, warrior. You keep this estate? I do. I'm Gottfried Fairrobe, celebrated Gringer of the great heathen army, trusted Golden Helm of Ragnar Lothbrok. I intend a clean and honorable battle as my days grow old and rotten. I wish to keep myself dignified in my death rattle. Your upkeep is impressive. My war garments are unblemished, well-groomed and pristine. Ragnar taught me self-respect when we summered here. A clean conscience, unblemished oaths, and immaculate loyalty are of higher value than any well-dusted piece of armor. A resonant thought. Now, will you oblige me? An honorable and clean battle is all I ask for now. May Odin visit us in this dance. Let us fight. Prepare your garb for a last drenching of raven wine. My battle irons are in prime condition. <laughs> Ah! Hail my, my battle irons are in prime condition. Right! 
such precision. Shall only use the sharp and aseptic. Only the purest. Bleed clean. Thank you for this last song of well wrought iron and immaculate blows. Go to your shining, flawless victory. Farewell, honorable Drenge. See you, old friend.
Give me a hand! Easy now. Something's not right. Jet, need to get on the other side. Aid me, be my eyes.
was out there. My prices are competitive. Yes. All right. Look here. Afton, good to find you here. The Raven Feeder returns. Now keep quiet. I'm hunting a band of traitors lurking about this swamp. Who told you there were traitors here? My scout. He asked me to join him here, but he is nowhere to be found. Have a look around. Tell me if you see something. Eivor, search the perches and lookouts here. He could be spying from above. Olav, speak to us. Where are you? I need your eyes, my friend. He's clinging to life. I should carry him down. I found your scout, but his wounds are grave. Olaf. Poor Olaf. He will be buried with honors. I will see to that. Walk the bridge, old friend. I will see you on the other side. Be Anton may track his attackers. Get them, boy! Good boy! Follow their trail! Thor lends me strength. Sniff them out, boy! We will paint the ground with their blood! Who are these men you suspect of treason? Thieves who stole my war spoils. Looks abandoned. Are you the trail ends, but nobody's here. Hmm. 
These pipes burst and flooded the tunnel. Even this old Roman work cannot stand ice. <laughs> Look there. The pipes cut through that wall. Could there be more rooms beyond? Hey, boss. Something's there. Hey! Hold on. We'll find a way through. I've done it. You must hurry. Here, a hidden entrance. They might be lurking below. The Romans were fine craftsmen. These chambers are vast and decorated and laced with piping. Yet they went mad and vanished, just like their gods. Moira's books tell us so. Ah, here, you see? Spoils of war. Mine! Stolen from me! I am beset on all sides, Eivor. ...by plotters and... ...schemers! What kings and jarls are not? Your territory is vast and wealthy. Every day decisions I make change the lives of thousands. It is a burden few could bear. Yet I do. I do. You spoke with Moira. What did you learn? She means well. I don't believe she would poison you. Not willingly. She also said she'd seen your illness before. In her own family, she said it came on slow, but was... incurable. No. No, this is not an illness. This is poison. Somehow, someone is poisoning me! Shh! Listen. These will be the thieves who stole my tribute. And half done. Well met. Come, fill your bellies with mead. You stole this tribute. By rights, this is mine. It was meant for me. We stole nothing. Faravid gifted this to us for a hard day's battle. And did you take my scout Olaf in that battle? Your brother in arms? Did he too have to die for this tribute? That was. that was Olaf? Damned fool! We thought he was a thief! The only thieves here are the ones drinking my mead and spit-shining my silver! You! Cowards and traitors! We are owed this bounty, Jarl! For battles won and blood let! Eivor, you tell him! This is treason, and treason is punishable by death. Faravid treated us better than you ever did. Faravid is nothing, and you are less. Glory! Glory for one! my hand. Take hold of your fear, Hafton. It can poison your mind. Faravid killed this man, not me. 
He forced my hand with slights and trickery. He... <coughs> Forgive me, I... I find it hot in these furs. The day must be warming. We have a meeting with Faravid. Is that not right? I do, at the walls. Yes, I know the place well. It is on the road between Jorvik and Pichiringa. Press him, Eivor! As hard as you can! Never let up! And bring me proof of his treachery, or otherwise! No right. They had no right to... It's rightfully mine. Show me.
of rot in the air. Stop! There's nowhere left to go. Please, don't hurt me. Why are you here alone? I remain with my family. The withering is taking them, but I do not wish to abandon them. The withering? A disease that often goes unnoticed until it is too late. The whole village had it. It destroys the mind and heightens aggression in an individual. And ultimately, the poor soul is rendered catatonic. Leave here, child. Your family will soon go, and this village has nothing for you. But... Papa! Mama! They will find peace in death. Live for them. They would want that. I... I... <laughs> You're right. I cannot hold on any longer to what is already lost. I will go. Here. A key, if you want to check on this yourself. If I'm to leave, I can't face them again. This town leaves behind a better legacy. But such is the way of this world. My head. It swims. Fairy. No! A demon. It will not save them. But at least it might ease their suffering. Hmm. A list of names. Ages. All killed by a plague. The withering. The stench. They've enjoyed much, it seems. Go, Sunan. Have a look soon enough. Yet still floating. Tell me, how did my old friend like his goblet gift? There were other things on his mind. Your man Ulfra, for instance. He died protecting the spoils he stole from Hafton. Ulfra. Poor Ulfra. I told him to mind your tongue, but he wags it like a slobbering dog. Was Hafton always so easily riled? No. Riches and glory have shaped him into something new. He is not the same man he used to be. What is this place? I expected an army ready for Warcraft. This was our first camp in Northumbria. I came here with Hafton and his brothers, Uba and Ivar. We besieged Jorvik and put King Alla in the cold ground. Those were good days, now too far gone. What is all this? My share of the treasure we took from those distant days. 
I buried it here for a rainy day. This bag is heavy with silver. Enough to pay for an army. Come! Race me to Jorvik, Eivor. Remind me of the glories long gone. You're too drunk to win a race. Then have a drink. Make it fair. What's keeping you, friend Eivor, waiting for spring? Not full of your words. See you in your way. Having trouble keeping up? My horse must be deeper in the cups than I am. What are we doing in Jorvik? You haven't said. Paying a visit to our kept King Rishie. Long may he reign. I haven't enough men to beat the Picts alone, but with Rishie and his feared, we'll finish them off. You would bring a puppet king into this fight, but not your Jarl. Shh! Keep this to yourself. The streets have ears, the windows have eyes. I did not agree to this level of deception. You should have told me this before. Eivor, my friend. If I describe my full strategy, we might yeah. never leave the campfire. Have a pie for the trouble. I prefer the light of a fire to the darkness of your plans. Skate. Don't do it again. Things are better now, are they not? Ever since our oh, how can this be your blasted name? been afraid to touch even a drop of wine since the Yuletide feast. One more reason to stick with Ale. I wish Yuletide happened every month. The daily slog kills me. Not if it happens the way Wait. A favor I must ask of you. Make no mention that Hafton is ignorant of our plans. It's better this way. Are you mad? Rishie answers to Hafton. You put this man in grave danger if he defies his master's will. Rishie cannot defy orders he has never heard, no? Trust me. I will take the blame should our plan fall apart. Eivor the wolf kissed and half done's cupbearer. What a curious surprise. I hope the day finds you and Jorvik well. Yes, we scrape by, with what little we still own. But this new war should make us wealthy once again. 
until our tribute is taken. I smell the bile on your breath, King. Do not forget who is in charge here. Oh, do remind me, Faravid. Yesterday it was half done, but today I hear whispers that you are leading the charge. I am confused. Yes, you answer to Hafton. And now he orders one final strike on the picked stronghold at Magnus. To make war with the North on such a scale will require a hefty amount of silver and a large force of men. My soldiers and silver are pledged already. I expect the same from you. I have given my aid as well. The battle must be decisive. I see. And you have these orders from half done in writing, yes? From the great man himself? Not with us, but you can rest assured Hafton has need of you. He expects a swift victory. I'm sorry, Faravid, but duty compels me to refuse. Without strict orders from Hafton, I will not risk the lives of so many. You deny me! I do. To gift you an army puts my wealth and reputation at risk. That's not what Hafton wants. He needs a strong and loyal king. You presume to know what Hafton wants. Hearsay is not enough. For all I know, this is another of Hafton's tests. The greatest snake in Northumbria that Saxon is. We need his army to take Magnus. And we'll have it. If we falsify orders from Hafton ourselves... You would do this? Draw up fake orders and pass them off as real? That's it, and I know just who to speak with. Hjor of Jorvik. He'll know what we need. Good. Hjor's favorite alehouse is nearby. Seek him there. Stretch your wings, Sunan. I'll cost more than bread. Things were better under Arden. Your your just where I hoped you would be. Eivor, gods! You have come at just the right moment. Right then, watch this. Go home or get hurt. But you won't bother my friends. Oh, bother who I please, after I brick your face to the brains! Oh. 
Eivor, always the fighter. Thank you, Ulfkist. Those men will wake up soon enough. With greater sense, I hope. What brings you back to Jorvik? Secret errands for Hafton. I need an army of men to face the Picts in the north. Has Hafton planned an attack he cannot afford? That's not like him. To be clear, Feravit made this plan, not Hafton. Does Haltan know of this plan, or...? He doesn't, but he's given me leave to act as I must, for reasons I cannot share. Yes, we've heard the rumors, and all our messages have gone unanswered. Can you aid me with some trickery? Help me forge a set of orders from Hafton himself to force Rishia's cooperation. You'll be taking quite a risk. You have my thanks. We can meet outside the Royal Hall, after you have the documents. Come raise a cup and lose Eivor, some silver! join me for a drink. You both seem to have settled well in the city. Yes, we do enjoy the comforts we have here. But I still think about Norway. The cold and the warmth. Stay on the road safe, Eivor. I try to. Remain loyal. Things were better with you around. Here, take this forgery and pray that King Rhysia sees nothing amiss. I trust you know what you're doing. Straight from Hafton's hand, as you see. Hmm. Yes. Yes. Well, if Hafton's loyal mules have pledged to fight... ...still, my help will come at a price. If you're speaking of coin... I remind you that your soldiers are mine. Hafton's, my good man. Hafton's soldiers, for these are Hafton's orders. Correct? But I jest. I jest. All is in order, then. If Haftan commands, I shall raise my feared, and you shall have your fighting army. Good. Get them marching at once. This must happen soon. As soon as they are mustered, Lord Faravid, and no sooner. Eivor, a moment with you? I'll meet you at Stenweir. Faravid is Hafton's man. So are the Hemmings of Nottinghamshire, as are we here in Jorvik. But not you. I don't like talk that dances around thorns. <laughs> For whom are you fighting, truly? I fight for myself and my people. As any great leader must. Why ask me of loyalty? What are you seeking? An innocuous question. Loyalty is a word that slides off the lips like honey. Sweet to the taste, but never lingering. There are things simmering in Northumbria, hidden from even you. Take heed, and have a care. Venerate should be waiting at Stenwyr.
Cautious around here. Survey the area soon. Do you see Sunan? about this land, my friend. My eyes.
Where's after and y'all? Will he be here? Where are the Saxons? We need them to take the fortress. Patience. Rishie promised an army. What about Jor and Jovina? Lovina is ahead with a dozen of Yorick's swords. Come. Our Saxon allies have reached Magnus. We should march. <laughs> Show me what lies ahead. Nice plan. I feel uneasy. sound. the battlefield once more, old friend. Yes, my Earl. As in days of old. Who are you to speak of the old days? The days when my word was bond. The days when the light of my glory lit the world. How dare you speak of those days as if they meant anything to a traitor like you? Who told you of this? My new ally is more loyal than my old friend. Eivor Two-Faced. That is your name. Gently, friend. I told Hafton because it was my duty. Enough bickering, all of you. We are at the edge of war. Preserve your rage for the enemy. Lufina talks sense. We fight this battle and we end this war. At this moment, nothing else matters. Look there. The pigs send a message. Raven Tamer, with me. You will talk them into a surrender with your sword sharp tongue.
These Picts came in. Turn tail and run back beyond the wall. The Romans built that wall to keep us out. But they are gone, and we remain. Someday you too will disappear. Wall or no wall, we have more gods than you. We may have but one god hidden, but we have many more friends. Who now is the rightful king of Northumbria? <laughs> the kingdom has spoken!
the sweet taste of victory! Maricia defeated. Was he the thorn at my back? The traitor I suspected all this time? Save your praise, Hafton. Rishi may yet live. That coward will be dead in a snowdrift somewhere. It matters not. This day is not done until we've seen his corpse. Do not relent. Not yet. Eivor, rise like an eagle or call like a crow. Spirits this day, traitor. <coughs> Faithful counselor, please help me back to Jorvik. Let my heart expire at home. I have no favors left to offer you, Rishir. Soon you will walk beside your god. But I... I see no light. I feel no warmth. Only... an icy darkness, a, a cave. Hell's frozen door welcoming you. What, what waits for me there, Eivor? What waits for me? Traitor's death for a treasonous fool. He was a hero in tales he told himself. A Saxon who loved his homeland. You cannot begrudge him that. There is something in that. No more Saxon kings, Eivor. 
I am through playing the puppeteer. The fate of this Shire rests on my shoulders alone. You'll take the crown yourself, and the extra burden it brings. I will. But I will not rule alone. My friends, my allies, will keep me standing upright. Let us talk of our alliance in Jorvik. Leave this king to his winter kingdom. Moira, is Hafton about? Eivor, welcome! Hafton has stepped outside with Faravid. They shouldn't be far. steady your balls! I'm going to shake asses with you. Shall we lock horns? If you suck it... Go on, steady your balls. I'll ask her to shake asses with you. Well, I've never danced with any group before. Ivan, I am and I'm power. Every scene the way we've sunk is Edbert has been man. Who wear all the in mind. Half Dan is not here. Where is he? Sonen, guide me.
appreciate. I struggle to be surprised. I was caught off. The other side must be barred. Well, I should not have been. The fog set in and I could not see the forest before. Long ago, we stormed this sea of wagons under Winter's Black. I have stood at my side for many long years. Proudly, well, come. Let's share the balm of all torments, the soothing liquid of chaos. The ceremony hastens to start. Let's not keep the crowd waiting. Eivor! Yes, let us go. To inscribe our names in history. No more pulling strings. Have you had enough fun? My crowning must come soon. I'll save some for later. Let's make a king of you. To Eivor and the Raven Clan of Mercia, our newest ally in blood and glory! Yeah! To Hafton King, I lift my horn and raise my brow to speak this praise. Crown Spire! Stout oak of Valkyries, spinner of battle wisdom. Long may you live and rule. Skull! Skull! <coughs> Moira, what is this metal? It's soft like Roman pipes. Ah, oh, that's lead. A toxic metal. And was it lead that drove the Romans mad? Can metal do this to a man? Oh, God in heaven, yes. The Romans knew this well. And my poor mother, she... She drank from cups like these for so long. She... You... All these years you gifted me poison! <laughs> you gifted me madness! Old friend, please. Your sickness has clouded your judgment. This sickness was no accident. I trusted you. She's your weapon, Ferovit. Eivor, make this man see sense. He's old, sick, and his mind is unclear. Oh, shit! You want me dead, you lying shit hog? I was a fool to not see it! Treason must never go unpunished. After all we did together? After all we won? If any of my clan committed such a betrayal, I would rip his flesh from his bones. You are not the warrior you used to be, my friend.
the end of our road. Stand, you treasonous bastard! Stand and fight me! Old friend, do you remember the days we raced our horses across the length of this land? You were always faster. You always won. Because I let you win, my Jarl. So I will let you win one last time. We will meet once more in the Corpse Hall. Afton, it's time I go. Hmm? I am leaving for Mercia, going home. And go with this. A sign of friendship. A bond between our clans, a symbol of the pain and suffering it took to win the peace. I hope we were right about him. The wind calls me back to Ranvi. Best tell her the good news. Rap, I think it up! 